don't like, Vada Fly gonna recap this and say Gotti caught a 30 on the John Road. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. That was crazy, y'all the game. Time has Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the fire fly. We used to rap it like that. I can't. Hey, yo, gout, this is what I gotta do. Play politics, not with you. We supposed to be the last of the best of them. See what that money do? Extra 5,000 we running through. Jump on a plane and I come to you. Just text B's what you wanna do. Just text me that he want too much for you. I got him scared and I'm comfortable. Since I sense fear, with the shots for you. This a new year, what you wanna do? News around here, put your name in the article. Free too remarkable, I'm too real. That in this year, God is asking us to be concentrated on our our lane and the finish line and amen, that amen, means amen 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 just focus on your lane and the finish line and the finish line. You already know what it do and what it does. So you got to ask what it was. Salute to the subscribers that notification gang. Rightsgangclothing.com for the merchandise. You heard me right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um did y'all hear a verbs interview on DNA Get Money and Drink Waters channel, dog. Yo. Go, 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 go watch that. Then come back here. You know what I'm saying? Watch that first. Then come back here. Salute to DNA and everything that he's got going on. Star is what make you money, not raps, bro. No, it don't. It's either you're a star or you're not. That's it. Stars get paid, not rappers. The, the part of being a rapper is a part of everybody. The, all these niggas can rap. But can you sell the ticket, nigga? <sighs> if you can't sell the ticket, nigga, then you're not talking. Because a person is not going to pay you. They pay you what you're worth to them. If a company feels that you're worth $2,000, that means they feel like you're only going to make them $3,500 or $4,000. Fucking I got to have my own. I got to hustle for my own. And any man out there got to feel me. It ain't about milking off the next man. That's a motherfucking hoe. I'm a motherfucking pimp. I'm finna come up on my own. I'm going to get my own sack. I don't want to be nobody's worker all my life. I Yo. <sighs> the rookies. Kid Chaos. I believe it was Kid Chaos. It was Holmesy. I think Easy the Black Captain was in there. Or whatever the case may be. I did hear it last night when I was at the gym. Um, yo. This was crazy, son. So, basically, I'm, 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 I'm paraphrasing, right? So, uh, Kid Chaos. Salute to Kid Chaos. I respect everything that he does. South Carolina, you know what I'm saying? Um, he was saying that Averb ain't got it no more. Like he ain't really like that. Like he, the the shit that he did versus uh, Rock and his last couple battles, he ain't really been like that. And I, he said he ain't been like that since I think Mook or maybe the DNA battle, right? So, um, you know, DNA is gonna give Verb a chance to 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 get his get his off. You know what I mean? And the thing is. DNA is at that level now that when you talk when you talk heavy about an artist. DNA could just pick up the phone and call him, like, yo, or get in contact with him, and you know Verb is coming. Verb is going to use levels of disrespect that are high, you know what I'm saying? Like, he's going to talk about, but see, the thing is, the angle that Verb took was sensible, you know what I'm saying, to most people with a clear, open mind, because a lot of the rookies who talk, yes, we know this for a fact. His 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 line was three thousand dollars. Yeah, a lot of these guys tonight, there ain't no rookie really getting three thousand dollars for a battle. You know what I'm saying? Unless they win the tournament. You know what I'm saying? He said Holmes he had to run, he said Holmes he had to run through like a hundred. He he almost had to die to get that twenty five grand. And so Verb's angle was like, yo, I could pay your my rent for two years and your phone bill for two years off of one battle. If Verb was getting paid that much money, was well, sheesh. These niggas giving out enough bread to bake biscuits for the whole project. Sheesh. But um, it's not. I, 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 he look. He used a jaded mentality when he's thinking about it because their premise, the rookies, was the fact that you don't battle. Your battles are not impactful anymore. You know what I'm saying? Like you're not having impactful performances. And I and me as me as a blogger, you know what I'm saying? I understand where they're coming from as far as with the performances from Verb. But Verb is looking at it like he don't care if he's impressive to none. He just wants to be impactful to a lot. Like he's his job at this point is not to for say take another person's fan base. Like he feels like if he battles versus a DNA 
when he battles versus a Tay Rock or whoever he battles that has a high name, he's like, yo, I'm not taking their fan base and they're gonna have, feel how they feel anyway. I'm doing movies, I'm doing this, I'm doing that. You know what I'm saying? They not looking for, I'm not, I don't got time to write. But he's saying that I'm still, if I performed at y'all level, if I brought it down to y'all level, I would smoke everything around. And he basically tried to get it, he basically got that KKR saying that, um, you know, you're not even beating the niggas that's there, you ain't winning the tournament, you know, and um, Kid Chaos wanted to get on and have a conversation with Verb, but Verb, he's the wrong person to be talking about you and you can't respond at the same time because he's playing you heavy like, yo, you don't deserve no conversation with me, like, I don't have to have no conversation with you, you looking up, I'm looking down. Now, while there are rookies who would probably bring smoke to Verb, Verb don't have to do it at this point. He's basically saying that a lot of these rookies are coming in the game wanting to be the best rapper. Like, yo, I want to be the best rapper. I'm the best rapper. Yo, I got the, the headshot, the big gun, the little gun, and all this other shit when it ain't really about that. I think being a good rapper is dope. It's a nice characteristic, but it's not everything. Being the best rapper is definitely not everything. Because if being the best rapper, the best lyricist meant everything, Excel would excel. Oh, shit. I heard that. Excel would excel. If it meant just being having the best bars, my nigga Excel would excel. Salute to Excel. He's dope, but he's one of the best lyricists, but it's a total package kind of deal. Kind of like how good is not the best lyricist, but he can rap. He got bars. He could meet you there. You know what I'm saying? Like he 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 got swag, he could flow. But everything is not for everyone. I would be foolish to think that every single person watches this channel or watches unbiased or watches black or watches cat you be you be a fool to think that people have their own set group of people who watch them you know what i'm saying there's people who probably watch me that don't watch something else or people that watch something else that don't watch me but i can guarantee when i cut this camera on and talk it's gonna be thousands of people coming to see what i got to say or coming to see what me and showtime sp got to say that's why you know i love what showtime sp does he's a great build help build this brand help do what he do but just best believe that if i jump in front of this camera by myself <laughs> it can still go <laughs> it can still go don't get it fucked up and if he jumped in front of this camera by himself he could hold his own so everybody has their own set base of people but verbs premise was a three thousand dollars saying that y'all not getting paid three a lot of people it's not verb verb needs to understand there are a lot of people who's not making three thousand dollars to battle, I'm making three thousand. I mean, <laughs> but <laughs> there's a lot of battle rappers who don't get paid like that. I just was talking earlier on Twitter. I said that they want A Ward to battle on URL, but niggas want him to battle for free, and he don't want to do that. That's the reason why you. If A Ward was willing to battle for free for a battle or two, he would be on URL already. But he knows his worth. Once you know your worth, you can't be compromised. Yo, I'm not battling for free. Why would I battle for free? I don't even do this for free. Why would, if I was doing this for free, I would have been gone by now. You niggas wouldn't even see me up here. Fuck am I doing this for free? Because you're taking so much time away from your family, away from your loved ones, away from your livelihood to provide entertainment. You better be getting paid. And that's why Verb said in his battle versus rock, you know what I'm saying? He was talking about, you know, you 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 do all this and that and leave and lose and get get the smaller bag and all of that. He was talking through. He was talking through um, his situation. But what I will say is this. Uh... When it comes to the rookies, yes, they making noise. Yes, they doing their thing. Yes, they got looks. Yes, they buzzing right now. But it didn't. It has not happened yet in front of 2,000 people or 1,000 people or 500. It has not happened yet. It's a different era. Verb did go on to say, yo, I came to New York, said fuck New York, and had to rap in front of everybody. Y'all ain't had that kind of pressure. And then there'd be rookies who be choking in the pandemic room. How you be choking and stumbling in the pandemic room <laughs> it is only who they let in. They had the store legacy and they, they wouldn't even let the niggas in the store. They was banging on the window. Tighten up is all I'm saying. They doing their thing. Kid Chaos is nice. Um, I, I, I told y'all I first heard Kid Chaos audio. I didn't even hear his battle. They sent me audio first and I said, yo, this nigga right here got smoke. I, recap, I was one of the first people to recap one of his battles when he was doing the Proving Ground thing and I know he's nice. 
continue to build the brand. He's got merchandise. Um, I've spoken to him about his merchandise and things like that when he helped get his brand off the ground. There's a lot of artists that don't have merchandise. Why am I as a blogger selling more sweaters than fucking rap battle rappers? These niggas don't got brands. These niggas don't got music. These niggas don't got YouTube channels. These niggas don't got nothing. They just sit around and wait for smack to hold their hand and they hum about kumbaya. This whole little we gonna rise together shit, it's not gonna work. He was telling the truth. Because everybody ain't going to make it. Everybody is not going to make it when the shit comes back. When that shit comes back, the big stage, bro, every year you all do this. They grab one or two niggas. Twerk, come on. Geechee, come on. Uh, Jerry West last year, come on. Rum Nitty, come on. They grab a couple niggas, they build them up. They're not going to build 25 niggas up. I guarantee you. They're only entertaining this now because it's the caffeine era. And Verb is trying to tell you this. They're only entertaining this because it's this era. But once shit come back... You are going to be impressive to a few, impactful to none. Yo, I'm telling you, I know that they might not like the way that the message was delivered, but even Mickey, Mac, Mickey Fax said this. The rookies want to be the best MCs, which is admirable. What Verb is saying is he don't care if you rap better than him. He proved himself. He's literally telling you how you can be a star and you're still going against the grain. Is why he was that in 08, but he don't need to be. Mickey Fax is another impactful MC who's letting these rookies know you have to become a star. The best rappers aren't stars. I'm guaranteed there's probably a nigga who does this shit right here that I do better than me, but it's not a star. You have to be a star. You have to be a reason why someone will turn the camera on or why somebody's going to stand there and listen to you. Anybody could talk about this shit. Anybody could talk about it. But are you a star? That's the big difference. Twerk. Star. Get you got it. Star. Rum nitty. Star. These niggas are stars. Av, star. They didn't come, they came in classes with 25 people. Everybody's not gonna make it. But I respect what Kid Chaos does. They came back and they had another one on DNA show. I didn't get to watch theirs because um, it was like almost 2, 3 in the morning. I'll probably peep it sometime today. But Nick, Verb was talking heavy. I was like, whoa. Sheesh. But um, other than that, salute to the subscribers, that notification gang. I really do appreciate everybody who checks out this content, whether religiously or passing. I say that shit because I mean it. And um, we're going to keep this thing going, man. Salute to every single one of y'all motherfuckers. Hey, yo, gout, this what I got to do. Play politics, not with you. We supposed to be the last of the best of them. See what that money do? Extra 5,000 we running through. Jump on a plane and I come to you. Just text B's what you want to do. Just text me that he want too much for you. I got him scared and I'm comfortable. Since I sent fair with the shots for you. This a new year, what you want to do? Lose around here, put your name in the article. Free too remarkable, I'm too real.